Oh, guys, I'm excited to play this. I really am. Uh, I've heard amazing things about Gone Home, and I'm really excited to play this. Um, I've never got around to playing it personally, but this is the first time I actually got to play it. I'm, I can't tell you how excited I am, because this is one of the most critically acclaimed games I've heard about in a long time that's from an indie developer, and a lot of my friends have told me to try it and play it, and I would love it. It just, and it, just looking at it right here, it just looks, and the, the, the ambiance and the art style just looks, sounds gorgeous. Yeah, it just... And, just, and you can tell it's just going to be a story that kind of sticks with you. Uh, and that will, it, it'll bring out a good story, bring, bring out a good uh, moment. Yeah, no, it's I, I'm excited. The story is going to be incredible because um, Mr. Steve Gaynor is the one that writes it, and I really like most of the work that he's written. So, if not all of it. So, without further ado, welcome guys to the first playthrough, or really the playthrough that we're doing for Gone Home. Uh, both of us have never played it before, and it's going to be a great ride, I feel. So, please enjoy, sit back, relax, and enjoy each video that we're going to do for the series of Gone Home. Thank you very much for joining us, and see you on the other side. Alright, so let's get right into it, guys. Uh, walk using the left stick. Okay, so kind of basic. Generic. Modifiers and commentary. Uh, these modifiers result in non-standard experience. Modifiers cannot be changed while in game. All lights start on for those who don't like the dark. <laughs> Disable map. There will be no map to guide you, unlock all doors. Oh, you uh, have all of these right off the bat? Yeah, I guess. Uh, disable hmm. voice diaries, Sam's voiceover, no ending prompt will appear while wow. it'll be up to you when to stop playing. Huh, interesting. Wow. Uh, enable, comment, or enable commentary. Icons appear throughout the house allowing you to hear commentary from the game. Oh! That's kind of cool. Uh, I mean, all of this I'm not going to do. I'm just curious what all this is about. Awesome. Alright. Let's get into it. <laughs> Why do I feel like this is going to be in, a, in not in the same way, but kind of in the vein of like Life is Strange? I know you never played it, but I, yeah, I'm looking I'm forward to playing that. I know you are, and it's a, a fantastic game. I, I just I'm getting that vibe right now. Um, on oh, the music at least, and the trailer kind of gave that feeling to that mixtape though, the original mixtape, the cassette tape. That shit fire. When mixtape drops. <laughs> the Fulbright Company presents. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so love you. See you soon. Bye. Please don't make me cry. <laughs> it's gonna make you cry. <laughs> I can't already tell. Stop it! Okay, so she called yesterday. It's 95. Huh. Pretty early. Or late. Oh, whoa. Oh. Oh, it's raining right outside. On some sort of patio? Yeah. Like... Yeah, it looks like the front doors are over here. Wow. I mean, this looks pretty good. Especially for an up-rendered uh, PS3 game. Are those Christmas lights? Yeah, those are Christmas lights. <laughs> That's a Santa. This is yeah. a Santa duck. Bad duck. duck. Christmas <laughs> Christmas duck? Christmas what? 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 Why is there such a thing as we a Christmas We should name duck? him. What's his name? I'm gonna name him Frederick. Ooh, Frederick. There's Frederick, you're 599! <laughs> Frederick! Nice. Mm. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, Frederick, I paid, paid top dollar for you. They did. I mean, they really did, though. You're beautiful. Oh, there's a key. Did you see that? There's a key. Ah. Uh -huh. That's. Oh, oh, I guess I'm ahead supposed of the to game. Do this. Frederick, I'm, I'm ahead of the game. <laughs> we'll see you later, buddy. See you, buddy. Keep the door open. You know, yeah, you're right. Keep the door open for him. I'll keep this one open. There you go. You know, keep an eye out for us. All right, check that one. Whoa. All right, I got some nice air. Look, look out. Man, I we got my passport. Fabulous. Fabulous. 
I got from a Europe trip. I mean, that is a 90s haircut right there for, like, teenagers and young adults. I mean, that that is classic late 80s, <laughs> early 90s. Uh, Caitlin Greenbrier. Uh, December 12th, 73. Uh, what is that? I'm trying to read what that 8 is for. can't read exactly April 8th? April 8th. Know, oh, that might be where she, when she, yeah, when, of... when, yeah, when she got it, yeah. Uh, so yeah, she yeah. got it on 84, or April 8th, 94, so this year, in April, and it expires in 04. Uh, okay, cool. <gasps> And then boarding pass, Amsterdam to Portland, transfer to Cincinnati. Oh, so she, we're in Portland, and she went to Arizona for or Arizona. Jesus, Amsterdam, a little more exotic than Arizona. You know, it's not as you know hot. There's a lot more drugs <laughs> that are free, and uh, a lot more sex, <laughs> which is you know always nice. And she had transfer to Cincinnati, which I feel bad for her. Cool, and then the house key. Spare key, that's how I back. Under Kurt, under Frederick. You Get it right, you game. Write, you write, you write. Oh, that's kind of cool. So okay. I'm assuming you collect journals. Neat. Hello, Mr. Plant. I wonder if I can plug it. No. All right. Hello, oh, there, Mr. Oh, Plant. Cup. All right. Hello. There's no coffee in here. This is bullshit. Bullshit. Oh, Do I take my stuff? Or... Same thing. This is her name. Portland. Yep, June sixth. So it's this... wow. It's a really rainy summer. Oop! Crap! Pop can. Give me it. Okay. Oh, it's unopened. I want it. I can't, I can't see it because of the light. I can't see it because of the light. There we go. Fizz, Fizz right, white ginger, ginger ale. ale. Oh wow, they even gave all the contents. Them carbs. Them carbs. <laughs> oh, it's 220? got 120. 220. 220 like carbs. Calories, 140. Yeah. Uh, almonds. Uh, are best for you, for your table. Don't tell me what's best for me, almonds. Bitch, Whatever. don't tell me what to do. Can I drink it? Nah, I guess no. not. Or do, do I have to put it right back? Okay. Oh, I just threw it. Never mind. <laughs> Fuck you, bitch. I'd be fizzy later. Get out of my hand. Fizzy, get fizz rack. Get fizzy, get fizzy with it. Nah, nah, nah. All right, Katie, I'm sorry I can't be there to see you, but it's impossible. Please, please, don't go digging around trying to find out where I am. I don't want mom or dad or anyone to know. We'll see each other again someday. Don't be worried. I love you, Sam. Hmm. What you up to, Sam? I'm assuming that's the sister. Drug deal went wrong. Yeah. They are in it. They are. Oh, damn. It's really dark. Oh. That flicker in light, though. See, yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't a horror game, but, but you know, you never know. Are they moving? What's this noise for? Oh, wow. Uh, Terrence Greenbrier, I'm assuming the dad. Uh, kitchen, boxes, boxes, master bed, TVs. Oh, that was lightning. Okay, I got worried for a second. I was like, is someone in the fucking house? I thought this was just a story game, not a horror game. I was not prepared <laughs> for this. Uh, insurance. So they either are moving into the house or they're moving out. It's one of the two. Boone County. Yeah, they have to be moving. Yeah, because their current address is Forest Grove, Oregon, which is in, Port in Portland. Mm -hmm. And they're moving to Boone County. Yeah, they're moving. Okay. Dear Katie, oh. so much has changed, even just since you've been away. We moved into this house. I'm at a new school, and my big sister being gone for a year doesn't make it any easier. It doesn't feel real, but I'm not going to let it phase me. I used to tell you everything, and if I can't do it in person, because you're off gallivanting around who knows where, I'll tell it to this journal, just like I was talking to you. Oh, it's actually kind of sweet. I mean, I gotta take a shit. It's been a long just, just drive on that bus next to that smelly old man. Way to kill my vibe. <laughs> really oh, flush the toilet! You can flush the toilet. Well, I mean, it's sanitary now. Sam forgot oh, to flush the toilet. 
Hey, hey, man. Wait. Zama Magazine. Why is Stephen King? Why is there an author magazine? It's someone. Oh, wait. I wonder if the sister is like a really like a really into writing, which would make sense because she has a journal, or That's if true. one of the parents has it. Yeah. Could be oh, a buff yeah. in that kind of kind yeah, of area. Maybe. Grab toilet paper. Soft what? Oh, soft, soft plus. plus. Oh, hey. That baby though. Hey. Now thicker. That baby. <laughs> baby looks quite you know what? surprised. Here. <laughs> Going right where it yeah, needs to. Yeah, really did though. What is this? Grab box. Quick, Quick fix. fix. Quick fix band aids. All right. How much were you band aids? Frederick was There's only five ninety nine. Grab cleansing powder. Peel here. What is cleansing powder? Is that I'm just getting, like for your butt? I'm gonna say that's for chafing. That's for cleaning. <laughs> that might be Whoops. for chafing. Oh, well, well that landed actually handsome? perfectly. Yeah, it kind of did. <laughs> oh, extra hand soap. We already got oh, some. Well, we already got right. some. Sam. Uh oh. I don't care. Sam's not gonna like this. Shit. Destroying her house. This is our house. <laughs> oh, all right, well, all right, there we go. There we go. Good I as actually, new. Oh, I was gonna try and take that run around the house. Can you? Ooh, I can grab this. Can oh. you grab water? Why is there no mirror? Get a little drink. I guess the game can't afford a mirror. <laughs> all right. Um. Can we search in the? Let's search the downstairs more. Yeah. That phone though. Did you see that phone? Well, it is the nineties. I used to have one of those. All those buttons, though. If we could die. This dial. is so old school. Jesus. Play messages. Sam. Sam. Hello. Sam. Sam, where are you? Really? I need to talk to you. Please be there. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so love you. See you soon. Bye. Well, uh, who is that? <laughs> All right, well, I'm assuming this, here we go. Sam, Daniel from the old neighborhood called. He wants to come see the new house, call him back. Mom, Daniel's a total weirdo. The only reason I ever hang with, out with him in the first place is he had Nintendo when we were with Hell yeah, Nintendo. Huh. Classic friends using each other for their Nintendo. I mean, that, I was friends with Kurt for that re Well, actually, that's not true. I was actually friends with more than that, but... He did have an Nintendo, though. I don't... Boone County. I... Grab my card. Okay. Can I grab... Can I... Get... Oh, no, that's it. <laughs> Ticonderoga? Yeah, so... Oh, family portrait. Ooh, look at that. A handsome man. Ooh. You know who he looks like? Your neighbor. Oh my. Right? No. Kinda. My neighbor's much less handsome. <laughs> yeah, good point. Dude, that's that is a great mustache, so, honestly. I'm assuming Sam is her, the youngest. Youngest? Mom, mm. Jan, Terry, Dad. And that's us and at the very top. That's a cute family. Um. That's okay. going, yeah, going here. Hello! Oh, what the hell is back there? Uh, you know what? What is it? No, 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 let's go. No, this is not a horror game, but I want to <laughs> check out the rest of the house before we do anything else. We need them like tissues. That... We need them tissues. We're, we're about to... Hey, it's a full one, though. We're about to cry. You know or we have to gonna... throw Wait, we're, we're a gonna... tissue box at a monster. Oh, I'm holding on to them still. You know what? Eat it, nerd. Uh, oh, we, well, we I have throw a, I have a horrible freaking baseball arm. Throw like a baby. <laughs> There's something in there. Behind there. You see that? Something's uh, behind. Board. Something's behind, yeah. Right there. Oh, it's a car. Oh, what the? Look. Have a dumb con. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Not gonna lie, that's actually pretty good. That, that got a chuckle. Oh, <laughs> Happy birthday, Sam. Uncle, Uncle Harvey. Harvey. 
Harvey, Harvey, Harvey Dent. Oh, really? Dick. Wow. Digged. Dug. Dig, dug. Dig, dug. Here we go. Okay, so directions. The cards there. Uh, to work from your house left on. Okay. One hour, ten minutes. What? Are you kidding me? You travel an hour and ten minutes to get to work from your new house? What the fuck? Why did you move? Why? What, what the fuck? Wow. Jesus. Maybe there's a reason. Yeah, well, I'm assuming, but... There's yeah, there's there's there. Okay. Where the fuck... I, I don't know. I don't know where anybody is. Closet? Okay. Yes, I can. All right, what we got? So we got board game. Over, Over the, the Alps. Alps. A novel traveling, traveling game. game. Two to six players. So was this freaking like Oregon Trail book book version or game uh, version? Game version, yeah. Book version. Jesus. Do you remember the Oregon Trail actual game? Yes, I played it while I was in college. So hard. It's yeah, it's still front hard. hall. Yeah. Good. Fellow Letterman jacket. School. Yeah, I remember those days. Uh, I don't believe there's anything else in here. Can we pick up the Letterman jacket? It didn't seem like it. Oh, oh that's our mom now. Uh, Janice Greenbrier, senior conservatives, forestry service. So she works for the forest. Community. So she's not at work. So also. she works for the county forest service. Huh. And I still don't really know what their dad does. Not 100% at least. What is that head? What? Oh, it's a mask. Pick up one of my trophies. Grab skull. Pick up my old track trophy. Regional track and field finals, 91, April. Long jump, wow, nice. I wasn't even born. <laughs> nah, I, no, we both weren't. Nope. Grab mask. God damn. That is... Hecho in Mexico, me in Mexico. I wonder how she got this. Unless she went on traveling to Mexico, too. Regional track and field finals, girl 100, the girls 100 meter relay, 90. First place. We can run. Huh. So she got first place and she got second place for. Uh, oh no, she got first place for this too. It's silver, but she got first place for the long jump. Huh. Neat. A lot of books here too. Oop, cabinets. And nothing in there. Well then, here. Anything? Nope. It's green up. Huh. Interesting. I don't really... Oh, crab book. What is it? Oh, shoot. Wrong button. Holy Bible. That's actually kind of an old Holy Bible, honestly. It's a very old Holy Bible. Open it? No, I mean, I, I don't know. I, I've been trying to see if any other buttons allow me to do anything, but nothing's really responding yet. Can I turn the light on? Anything? Oh, here we go. Frederick? <laughs> I mean, Frederick. Or Boone County telephone books. How many telephone, telephone books do we need? I mean, I guess enough to, you know, have one in every drawer in the house. What's in here? Well, it would appear nothing since nothing. Oh, uh oh, uh wrong one. Can I close this? Uh, I know I can. There it's, we go. it's in a weird angle. There we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, Read there. Oh. Okay. Oh, this cursing. This should be interesting. Uh, <laughs> dear Jan, it's so good to hear from you again. All this new house business sounds like quite the adventure. Remember the little dorm room we shared freshman year uh, when we were miserable uh, fantasizing about our dream ho uh, homes? I always said I wanted a mansion. You said you wanted a house in the woods. Look who caught both. Uh, somebody up there likes you. Uh, I could use some of that magic. Send me some lotto numbers. I'll play them seriously. So we live in the woods. Yeah, I mean, it is Oregon. I mean, Oregon's basically just yeah. a bunch of trees. It's halfway to, like... It's basically a warmer Canada. Uh, but Slightly. I should be complaining about this good old split-loved... Uh, or, good old... Wait, hang on. This good old split-loved... We've what? had since Bob got transferred to Winnipeg. Oh, lived... Or, wait... Split lived. I don't. But I know. shouldn't be complaining about this good old uh, split. 
I don't know, man. We lived, uh, we've... Split level! Split, split level. level! Like a how split level. We've had since <laughs> Bob got transferred to Wimbledon. See, this is why I hate cursive. I can't <laughs> tell half the time what the fuck is being written. <laughs> we just got uh, new vinyl siding, jealous yet. Let me know if you ever want to trade places. So how are the girls doing? How's Kate, uh, has Kay left on her big European adventure yet? Speaking of jealous, write me back soon, Missy, Rumi, Carol. So I'm assuming this is Ma, uh... Mom's former roommate. Yeah. College I, roommate. D yeah. I mean, it's pretty cool. But, uh, anyway. Let's see here. Eric, did that? Oh, oh, oh. I thought stuff was on the floor. Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. And it's locked. Alright. Alright. This is behind uh, door number two. Pick up the Kleenex. We need to throw something yeah, at the you're demon. Right. You're right. You know what? I'm gonna put him back. I'm a big, strong woman. I'm a strong, independent woman. I'm gonna grab a marker and draw on his face, though. Give me that marker. Pencil, pencil sharp. Give me that marker. Nope. Damn it. Give me the marker. Damn it. Oh. oh. <laughs> there we go. You got it. Bring it here. You know what? I'm gonna close that drawer real quick in case, you know. Maybe. That? There we go. What? Did you hear something? I, I, I heard something. I, think I heard, like, just... a door open or something. What the? Okay. I think. All right. Uh, let's go say hello to our no. say hello to our Damn. friendly demon. Oh well, I guess I can't carry the pen. All right. Well, I'm gonna close the door. Maybe it was just the light. I don't know. Oh okay. So we just got done doing the foyer. Yeah, we pretty much checked everywhere so far. Everything. Oh, the TV's, TV's left on. Someone yeah, that left it on. I, I heard something. I was like, it's like, what the fuck is that? Oh, noise? picture? Grab a photo. Oh, this is the picture from, uh. Who is this? I don't know. Pink hair. Oh, uh, it's De Des DeSoto, yeah. And it's kind of folded. I wonder if this is that girl that called Sam. I wonder as well. That would make What's sense. What's the obituary? Yeah, yeah. Oscar Doc Mason, 60 Boone County, died peacefully last month in his home. Uh, Mr. Mason was born on September 8th, 1993, in the house that would be his home for the rest of his life. He attained his degree in pharmacy at a young age. and returned to Boone, Boone County to practice, he quickly became a loved figure at the Siren community. In the decades preceding his past, uh, passing, he was seldom seen outside his home. Uh, survivors are Terrence Greenbrier, as well as the spirit of people in Boone County. Oh, so this was, uh, hit, uh, the uncle to our dad. Oh, okay. Okay. Pack of cards. Playing cards. A cheap playing cards. Okay. Cool. Got my face. Can we read that note, or no? No. no just wait, what note? That looks like a note. Oh, okay. Postcard. Hey, it's, uh, what does it say? Hey, it's one, one of the postcards that sent Paris. Hey! Hi, Mom and Dad. Uh, in Paris, I've done many... Parisian things, including eating <laughs> la petite de Vianneur and wearing a beret. I'm going to have lots of film to develop when I get back. Uh, Sam, I'm bringing you back something from a Shakespeare book company the since you're my favorite Asian sister. Man. Love you all, Katie. Uh, one Arbor Hill. <laughs> yeah, I guess she's not the only one that's not used to that place. Oop, I can crouch. I did not an accident. Oh my god, you are so lucky you finished high school before we moved into this house. So, it's the first day of school, and there I am, introducing myself to the class, and I say that I just moved into the house on Arbor Hill. All of a sudden, every kid in the room turns and just stares like I suddenly transformed into a mutant. I just stood there, wishing pretty hard for a rewind button. Because now maybe nobody knows my name, but they all know who I am. The Psycho House Girl. <sighs> Great. Huh. Hmm. Check out that button. I feel like she's gonna get bullied. Mm. Heavens to Betsy? Who's Betsy? No idea, but it has something to do with the heart, so I have no idea. Betsy. Uh, Doesn't look like I can pick up anything else. Mm, you'd be correct. Low boxes. Just boxes. 
Alright. Alright, let's go check out this TV. Yeah, that smoke detector is working though. That's good. What's on here? Whoa, is this it's TV room? Shit. No, this is a different room. An office, it looks like. Yeah. What is this? The killing of JFK, a theory. You've seen the movie Discover the Truth, Benjamin Allman. Uh, conspiracy, so conspiracy, conspiracy. Basically, a thrilling theory. I couldn't put this book down. Important new look at the circumstances surrounding one of the greatest tragedies of all time. <laughs> yeah, it's probably about. Oh, didn't mean to actually throw me, but. <laughs> Fuck you, whatever. JFK. What? Hey, don't say that. He's a great president that did very little because he was killed. He was in great things. Anyway. Damn, dude, look at this typewriter. Alright. Oop, three ring binder. The electronic typewriter. Oop, then there's no paper in here. There, there's nothing in there. <laughs> Alright. Someone's been real hard at work. What about that paper on the ground? Oh! Yep. Oh, hey! John Russell opened his eyes and saw them. The stars twinkling as if he were lying on the grass and his family is a yard in Massachusetts, even though the place was a million miles away. No, he blinked the sheep sleep from his <laughs> eyes looking through the carbon reinforced safety glasses of the space station Archimedes yes he was a long way from home but the future needed him tell me why I messed up two different words and they are much less difficult than Archimedes whoops tell you said I'm pretty sure Archimedes oh Archimedes uh, John Russell's head swam he fell incredibly drunk despite not having touched a drop in hours he vomited onto his feet his bare feet he stared for a moment uh, don't know what those symbols are. Processing his sleek, flecked toenails, scanning up his bare shins, bare knees. He was completely naked. He looked up and met the eyes of a gorgeous blonde woman wearing a tight poly polymer fiber tunic. That's how I like to wake up. The fa the fabric that strained at the seams to contain her gorgeous bosom was replacing <laughs> yeah. with the phrase matter transference operator. Then he passed out. Oh, yeah, those are like, uh, crossing out. Those are X's. Like after he printed, I love how there's a typo. Because isn't the W key right by the E key? Yeah. It's a typo. Uh, John Russell, I crossed the gap. The gap in time. Only messages have passed before. But now, and man, they needed him. Now more than ever. Changing the past was no longer good enough. The instructions from the council had been clear what to procure, what to construct from it, how to assemble it so he made the machine, how to transport him boldly across time. And now he stood. They're on the bridge of the starship Archimedes, comma, and the of the vessel, command of the vessel, because only he, who had saved the president's life twice before, could helm the naive crew to their destiny to fade the galaxy. Yeah, this guy slowly became more and more like, man, you made a lot of mirrors. Like, this first one was alright, at like, very little, but, like, bad with it. And this one, I was like, alright, you have some things you need to tweak. And this one's just like, wow, you... I have a lot done. All right, well, oop, glass. Back to basics. You can do better. Step back in time to Dallas 1963 again. You can do better. What if JFK wasn't what if JFK? JFK? Early what? Utopia. Chinese, I, Japanese, JFK, Lebanese, USSR, coalition, Chinese, Japanese, Lebanese. Advanced technically and World War II early. What is up with uh, being early obsessed space with flight, utopia, JFK? Uh, paradox results. What the hell is that? I'm assuming that's rainwater. I really hope there's uh, no one behind us. Paradox results in JFK death being desired outcome. Record JFK off HBO, magic bullet theory. So pretty much he's trying to make a novel that's about conspiracies of well, JFK? Supposedly he's making a novel like from what that sounds like. He's, he went back in time and saved like JFK and stuff uh... like that. Uh, Pioneer. So he bought a disc player? I'm not reading all that, but he... <laughs> if you happen to be market for a combination LD CD player, you'll be glad to know that the Pioneer... Yeah, he bought a Pioneer CD player. And that's the receipt for it. Huh. Interesting. Huh. Anyway. There we go. Anything in here? Nope. Uh, 
Uh, Exam four. Here we go. Uh, Pacific Insurance Masters, Insurance Applicant, Terrence. Uh, okay, so this is electrical inspection form for the new house. Uh, does it meet local codes? Are there any deficiencies? Uh, it says unclear. Uh, wiring a house is technically up to safety and amperage requirements. However, multiple layers of wiring have been added to the structure of the last 100 years. System is frequently unpredictable. Lights blink uh, out for no reason. Pressure on floorboards and door frames disrupt circuits when directed behind the surface properly. Reworking the electrical system would be highly destructive to the walls, floors, and fixtures of the structure. I have a discussion with Mr. Greenbuyer. Since there are no current safety concerns, issues will not be addressed. Okay, so pretty much... He was like, oh, you know, there's nothing wrong, but, uh, um, it seems like nothing's wrong. Oh, can we turn this on? Oh, uh, nice. Wow, it's the slowest moving fan. Yeah, how Does that even put help? anything That's... out? <laughs> no, it does not help anybody. That's lame. All right. I'm going to check this real Oh, oh, Shit. whoa, we need a competition for that one. Hmm. Hmm. Very interesting. Like a, uh, Probably will, oh. like, later on or something. Yeah, probably. Oh, what? No, of course not. Uh, interesting. Uh, anything up here? Eh? 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 A book? No. Oh! oh bottle. A bottle. Oh. Uh, Hannah Got Graham. some whiskey. Whiskey distilled from Ireland. What you know? Uh, corn, natural spirits, and barley spirits. Established okay. 1911. Well, I'm gonna carry this with me because I want to get drunk and drunk because my parents oh, are here. Oh, break. Fuck you guys. Okay. Well, before we enter this, whoa, that is a creepy looking room. Before we enter the room, we're gonna call this episode here, guys. So thank you very much for tuning in and for seeing the first episode of uh, the Gone Home playthrough that we're gonna be doing. Yeah, I'm very interested in this. It seems very ambient and very. Very story-driven, like we thought it was going to be. Very, yeah, I um, completely agree. Um, and lots of questions to be answered. That yeah. phone call. That yeah. phone call is very... Hmm. I'm not sure what to think of that, but I don't know. Very and Frederick! Frederick! Frederick. Don't forget Frederick. Fred Duck! Frederick the Duck. He's our boy. Anyway, thank you guys very much for joining in and for watching the episode. Please check back for more on this, along with a lot of other things, such as Rocket League and whatnot. And as always, have a great day, guys. See you later. Peace.